Few people, old or young, are not attracted by a puzzle, whether a simple wire puzzle or a more involved jigsaw. But the reason isn't at all puzzling, it makes you think. The origin of the mechanical puzzle was not amusement, but security. The old Egyptian wooden lock was a neat little puzzle, though it looked easy enough. And what of some of the metal locks of long ago? Their complicated mechanism was enough to confuse the brain, and that was the intention. Today, almost every paper has its crossword puzzle, but it's by no means a new idea. Our great-grandparents knew it as a crossword square. Great fun between a rat, a tar, and Ada. Want to play, Auntie? Come on, then. And the same sort of magic could be performed with numbers, whether across, down, or from corner to corner, the answer's always the same. Another puzzle of the 90s was the hidden face. Can you spot the lady? You spotted her? Well, you are a rascal. But maybe the greatest poser of all was the permutation puzzle. The idea is to shift the pieces from here to here, one at a time. But each piece must be placed only on a larger piece or on an empty spike. Mathematics show how it's done. The figure three means the number of pieces, and here's the formula. So for three pieces, it takes seven moves. Now watch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. An Eastern legend says that ever since the creation and working day and night, priests helped by beautiful temple dancers, ha <laughs> ha, have been working out the puzzle with 64 pieces. Well, our formula applied to 64 shows how many moves. At the rate of a second a move, it will take 5,000 million centuries. And talking of puzzles, oh gosh, it makes you think. <laughs>